Hey, KIC here. Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. On the last episode, we actually relocated all of the raptors. Yeah, look around. All six of them are gone. They are all over at the mining colony. Mining outpost. And uh, with some luck, they'll all survive. I, I don't know what to expect at this particular moment. You have a bunch of stuff on you. Good. So, I kind of mentioned in the last episode, it might be interesting to look into doing something like, oh, I don't know, maybe making some places to breed and do stuff to hatch eggs. And I thought, well, let's go ahead and take a look at that. I have an idea of how I would like to do this, and I, I don't know if this is going to be a good idea, but whatever. We're going to... Hmm, I kind of like the idea of leaving a little bit of space between the wall. Maybe something like that. It's not quite a full foundation's worth. Actually, it is. I take that back. Good. Well, we're going to do... Oh, I bet I need to make more of these, don't I? Yeah, I really do. It's okay. It's okay. I can... I can go sort of take care of that. It's going to be slow and painful, but it can be done. Now, I'm just taking a look here at how I'm going to do this. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, I don't know if I like that, actually. Maybe I want to go one more. And hmm. See, here's what I kind of have in mind. If you aren't familiar with it, then you should probably know that, and, well, and maybe it's been fixed at this point, I don't know, but eggs sometimes fall through foundations, so I'm a little hesitant to put anything, to put foundations down and put eggs down on them, and then not being able to find them, well, that would be kind of terrible. Now, obviously, a T-Rex egg, it's fairly sizable, so it's going to stick up out of one of these, unless maybe, I don't know, maybe at this extreme end of the height right here, maybe it wouldn't stick out. I'm not 100% sure on that. But the smaller eggs, like, say, your raptor eggs and your etc. eggs, I'm not convinced that they're actually going to be able to make it in here, so I don't know. We're going to do something like that. Um, hmm, maybe I should have emptied that one. This one probably should have been blank. Okay, well that's fine. I'm going to take care of making some more materials, because clearly I need at least two more foundations, or one more foundation. I'm not sure. I need, I need more foundations. I know that much. So I'm going to run over to Ray here, and I'm probably going to need more walls than I planned on as well. So... Let's just go ahead, and I don't have thatch. You have a bunch of thatch on you, buddy. So him and I, we were out running around, and I basically dumped his entire inventory as best I could, just because I knew this was going to be problematic if I didn't. Now, I have a ton of fiber on me. I kept that because that's lightweight. It's amazing how quickly you can, you can grab all that stuff when you're using the scythe. A little sickle. Yeah, I... Don't know why I never got around to one of those sooner. I, I should have. I absolutely should have. You know what? Let's go ahead and grab some more wood. Let's do some more walls here. I, I made, I don't know, 18, 19, 20 or so just to get started. Um, Six. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. Wow, I'm going to need to do a bunch of them, I think. Oh, I don't even know if I did enough ceilings. I might not have. I need more thatch now, don't I? Yes, I do. All right, let's do this. Let's see what that's going to end up with. That'll be about... That might be about good enough for now. Just to, to see where things are going. Because I haven't entirely planned this whole thing out. I've taken a good look at where I think I'd like to go with it. And, um, you know, I figured I would figure out the rest as we go. Now, one thing I'm not particularly enamored of, and I'm going to do it anyway, is I'm going to end up using one of these larger gates for the doors. We'll see how that works out. I'm, I don't know. I'm a little worried about that. Hey, look at that. Skywalker dropped an egg. Go ahead and take that, just because that can be used to make some kibble. Go ahead and pick that up. And now I am totally weighed down, I think, because of the egg. So why don't you go ahead and hold on to that? And we'll give you some more weight, because she is a weight bird. I like using her to just fly around and load her up with stuff. That way I can basically gather what I need. Works out pretty well for me. 
So we need to go ahead and fill in that gap right there. And my inventory is too heavy to jump. So I'm going to give you my walls. You 20 ceiling tiles. That's what I did. That's not really enough, I don't think. But it'll have to do. So the thing I'm not going to like about this is I'm not going to have symmetry. And I don't know how this is going to work out either with... Hmm... Okay, so what I'd like to do is we're going to go ahead and demolish this one. And then I think we'll need to demolish that one as well. I'm not 100% sure about that just yet. Uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll have to see how that goes. I'm, I'm not sure just yet. I'm going to go ahead and grab those walls from Big Man over here. And I'm totally weighed down. Okay, so here, you hold on to that wood, and maybe, since I didn't actually mean to jump on him in the first place, we can go ahead and place some of these walls down. I'm really just looking to get kind of the beginnings here. We might need to finish this on another episode. Just There's turning out to be a lot more work to this than I was thinking there would be. So we're going to go walls all around. Thankfully, these are all facing the correct direction, so as soon as I turn the corner here, they're not going to be or they are going to be. Whatever. I'm good with that. That's less work for me. How about you? Wow, they are all on the correct side. I wonder if something happened and that was changed somewhere. I'm going to go ahead and stop right now because someone has it. A uh, shadow, I think, you have these. I think I made the right ones. I hope I didn't gather a bunch of materials I didn't need not really tried to use one of these in this way, so, um, I crud. Yeah, I, I had a bad feeling about that. Okay. Um, I guess that's locked on there. Ah, uh, crud, I hope. Nope, that doesn't look very good at all. Okay, well, whatever. I'm, I'm not sure if this is going to work. This is all, like I said, this is all just kind of coming together as I'm doing stuff, so I I don't really know if this is going to work. That gap is probably going to be problematic. I suspect I'm going to need to take a few minutes to go gather materials so I can... Oh, look at that. I had a bunch more walls on him. I didn't realize that. I thought I only had a few on him. I'm probably going to need to take a few minutes to gather some materials because I, I suspect this is going to be closed. Well, I'm going to need to take a few minutes to gather materials anyway, just because I'm going to have to enclose this entire building if we're going to be able to turn it into a hatchery. So just go ahead and finish placing all these, oops, walls here. Whatever, we can leave that wall up there, I guess. That's not where I meant to go. I'm going to need to make some ramps, too. That's why I've left some gaps here. Well, the gaps are in part for other reasons as well, but yes, we will need some ramps. Like I said, this is um, kind of an experimental building. I don't know that it'll work. It's, uh, I don't know, it's, it's an experimental building. That's, I think, the best I can absolutely say right now. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work at all. That's a shame. I'm pretty sure I'm going to need to tear all this stuff down and just go with a regular door, which if that's the case, that that's kind of a bummer. I don't know. I'm going to play with it and see what happens. Maybe it'll... Well, you know what? Here, I... It's just materials. What does it matter? You should have some ceilings on you. I can't even move with all those. Um, I didn't even bother to put my gate down. I figure... What's the point of putting it down if it's actually not going to work? Let's just try this for kicks. I mean, you know, it takes me a while to gather all this stuff. I'm not going to lie, but... I am kind of curious to see if this is going to work, so... You know, why not? If it does, then it saves me a little bit of work. In which case, I'm on board with that. Okay, one more. Put you down over there. 
Yeah, it's going to take me a while to gather all the, the wood for this stuff again, but that's okay. It's all right. I'm just trying to keep in mind how many ceiling tiles I want to go. I think two is actually sufficient. Because technically, if you look down here, this is going to be kind of three high. All right, let's go ahead and give you all of these. And then I'm going to go ahead and place the gate. I meant to give you those, not the gate. And let's just go ahead and pop you in place right there. That looks really goofy. Ah, look at that. It did work. It actually it did work. I'm... Hmm. Okay, well then, I'm going to run with that, because that worked. Let's see what I have for... Uh, thank you. Let's see what I have for wood here. How much does a ramp take? 60, so I can only do one. I think I'm going to need more than that. I think I'm going to need a couple of ramps, but we can just place one for the time being. We'll place that... Um, um, no, I can't place that there. Okay, there we go. Why can't I place that one there? I can place it there. I'm just trying to think, you know, it might be... Actually, that one's probably the least necessary of all. I really just need to put the one right there. I was just thinking, I'm really trying to make sure I can get various creatures in and out. Uh, you know what? Here, I can... I can go break this wall down that I said we'd leave. <laughs> Assuming I can reach it. There we go. That way I can just go ahead and get some more materials. And then I think I will have enough to make one more ramp. Go ahead and do another ramp right here. And we'll switch back to the inventory. So we should be able to place a ramp down here. Now the reason I want a ramp here, and I don't know where I want it. Do I want it here? I guess that's the straightest shot. The reason I want a ramp right there is because I want whatever hatch is down here to have a chance to walk out without any problem. Now, theoretically, this building will work. I don't know if that's going to be true, but um, this is, uh, I guess, a decent start. It looks really janky. I am I might take it apart just to... Uh, See if I can put another ramp in place and then maybe straighten this out a little bit. It, it looks a little janky to me. I, I don't really like that. And then, I mean, I guess I technically have these extra walls. I might put them up anyway, just all around to, to give the illusion of something. But um, I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'll just leave it like is. The second half of this building, though, is going to involve a lot of metal. So we will take care of that on the next one. This is the beginning of the hatchery, though. I'm I'm kind of liking what I'm seeing thus far. It's not great. I'm not saying this is any sort of technical wizardry. And like I said, this is all kind of unplanned, and uh, I haven't really tested this. This is not going to be the ideal hatchery for everyone. Let me just go ahead and say that, since I didn't really mention that. And I'll, I'll try to remember to say that again on the next episode, because that's really going to be true. But this, I think, will be... Um, I don't know if it'll be ideal for this particular area, but I think it'll work out such that it'll be pretty decent for this area. Uh, this area does not get super hot. It does not get super cold. So because of that, I'm not going to need perhaps as many materials as others. Man, I need more wood in there still. Crud, sorry. I'm just kind of checking all the stuff as I go along. But I do think it'll end up being a pretty pretty fun idea. Let's go ahead and just throw some of these guys back in there. So I'm not going to need all of that wood. There we go. That'll combine those. Yeah, I knew you were going to run out. I don't think 15 is going to be enough, but that's okay. So we'll take care of some of the some of the, uh, the rest of this stuff on the next episode. I, I hope we'll be able to get through all of it. I would like to be able to get through all of it. And at the very least, it should be much better than this. You remember this? This is where uh, Baruthiel hatched more or less. Yeah, I think it's going to be better than that, but we'll have to find out on the next one. So till then, thanks for watching. See you later.